Well, the theory behind the introduction of the mark was the difficulty we were having with the decline of the high catch in recent years, and I suppose it's coming from the fact that goalkeepers are now going for increasingly for short kickouts because there's more of an obsession with possession, as they call it now, to try and hold possession and work the ball off the field that way. Um, and I suppose this is just something that should incentivise goalkeepers to kick the ball out the middle of the field because it gives the catching midfielder a little bit more of a chance when he comes down with the ball, he has a wee bit of space to play the ball away freely. We're hoping it's introduced on the 1st of January 2017 um, and it's a, it's, a, it's, it's a change in the sense that we hope that coaches now start understanding the significance and the importance of the high catch and appreciating uh, the role that the high catching midfielder has in the game. We can all remember some of the greats of the game as I mentioned in Congress, Willie Joe Padden, uh, John McDermott and the likes Dermot Early, some great catchers, Jim McKeever, Anthony Tohill and it's just, uh, I suppose we want to create a new generation of majestic high catch and midfielders around the middle of the field. The motions this morning uh, on you know, doing away with replays and bringing the dates of the All-Ireland Finals back uh, lost very, very narrowly and will probably come up again because they are part of a package of proposals that were, I suppose, aimed to try and give the impetus back to clubs because clubs are, I mean, we don't want to be cliched about it, but clubs are what we are about and the club player represents 98% of what we are and I'm disappointed that those didn't get through because we put a lot of work into the ones last night thinking that we would need to get, the, 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 you know, to have a lot of eloquent speakers on those. There's, that's the under 17 and the under 20 and I suppose we maybe didn't consider enough uh, that we needed a lot more support for uh, the ones this morning on, on the on the dates of replays. I understand why provincial councillors in particular would want to hold on to replays because they are an additional source of revenue but all of that does come at a negative consequence to our club players.